开始清扫。Hey guys, Adam Lobo here, and you're watching Adam Lobo TV. If you're new, do consider subscribing to the channel, and don't forget to hit the bell icon just next to it to get notified whenever I release a new video, as I release new videos every single week. Now, similar like smart home cameras, there's so many robot vacuums in the market today that will make you go, which one do I get? It even took me quite a while for me to decide, so as usual, I researched crazier than I usually do and I decided to collaborate with the people from Ace Pro and they sent out the Xiaomi Mi Robot Vacuum, so here's my review. Now the Xiaomi Mi Robot Vacuum comes with a huge brown box. Obviously, since the item is bigger than the average smart home tech product, it comes with the instructions manual in Chinese, of course, a charging station with a very nice cable management at the back, a charging cable which is a 2-pin China socket where you might need to get an adapter depending on which country that you are from. The box also comes with a brush to brush your beard. Ha ha ha, just joke. Starting with the build quality, the material of the vacuum is made from ABS with the dimensions of 345mm times 345 x 96mm in height. It's about 3.8 kgs. It has a battery of 5,200 milliamps, which lasts about two and a half hours on a single charge, as opposed to the infamous robot vacuums like the Dyson 360i, which is about 40 minutes. It has a high suction power of 1,800 pascal and a lowest noise coming out from the vacuum compared to every single competitor at only between 62 to 68 dB. Now going back to the device itself, there are a total of 12 sensors where the main ones are the collision sensors with absorbing bumpers which helps with the collision of home furniture or obstacles. There's also cliff sensors underneath to prevent the device from falling. Then there's also the laser distance sensor on top, also known as LDS to accurately map the room, almost similar to the technology of self-driving cars. Nice. Now taking a look underneath, there is a counter rotational rubber brushes with three nylon sweepers, a roller and a thick rubber height adjustable wheels which helps to adjust over bumps and carpets while cleaning and moving around. Now the storage is right on top which is very easy to access and holds up to 0.42 litres which also has a HEPA filter. Now after plugging in the charging station, you will need to first reset the vacuum you will need to open up the top door flap, press the power and the home button together for about 3 seconds, then there will be a voice prompt in Chinese. Now the Xiaomi Mi Robot Vacuum connects through Wi-Fi, which you can control through the Mi Home app which is available both for Android and iOS devices. Now similar to the other products featured for the Mi Home app, make sure to first change the locale to China go to the plus button on the top right of the app, touch the scan button below of the app, the app will then discover the Mi Robot Vacuum, click at it once it's discovered. Next, the app will then search for your Wi-Fi, enter your Wi-Fi username and password and hit next and you're connected. Touch the vacuum in the list and you'll be welcome with three video tutorials if you like to watch it. If not, just agree to the user agreement and you're in. Now at the home screen, there are three icons below. First is Dock, Clean and Balance. And right on top of those icons, there's the cleaning area in square meters, the battery percentage and the amount of cleaning time in minutes. Now going further into the settings is where you can go through adjustments for timer, DND mode or do not disturb mode, full speed, notification, cleaning history, how many hours remaining for the filter, side brush, main brush, which is a very useful feature so you don't have to go guessing when it's time to change them. At the remote control settings, there is a spot, clean and dock controls, voice packs, 
user manual and customer service and the overall general settings for you to rename the device and other additional settings. Now let's start the device, go back to the home screen and hit the clean button. You will hear a voice prompt in Chinese and it started. Very simple. Another great feature is while it's cleaning, you can map the vacuum's position and once the area is properly cleaned, it will generate a map of the whole area. <laughs> Alright guys, now it's time for me to take the Xiaomi Mi Robot for a spin and see how it performs with different situations, so let's check it out. Alright guys, welcome to the studio once again and now I have a combination of oats, some cornflakes and also some hard wheat bix. And this would be representing the so-called dirt or the debris that I have. I'm going to take this, I'm going to scatter around the floor. I've created like a small virtual room here where I blocked it with Brendan's amazing guitar case and the carpet roll. So this would be the whole area where I plan to clean with the Xiaomi Mi Robot Vacuum. Now I'm going to be scattering it around the whole area including some of the in between the tripods which I see and see whether it knocks down anything or whether it cleans off. Knocking down stuff is okay because I can always use the virtual wall, but let's see how it cleans off properly. So I'm going to bring it right now. Alright, so this is how the dirt looks like scattered. I put some in between the chair, some between the lyric stand, some between the very light tripod. I also put in some nearby the amp area. And also some behind of the amp area is pretty dark, so you can see. I think I just put some at the back of the amp. Yeah, I did. So I'm going to be doing a overall test. So let's check it out. Alright, so looks like it's completed. Don't see any left. Me just a tiny bit over here and here, but that's because the chairs are in between and also a tiny bit here. But majority everything else is cleared. So now let's just quickly look at the storage area. Oh, oh there she's talking. So it's all inside here. Pretty amazing. There you go. Alright, so very good indeed. Back to the studio. Okay, thank you. Alright guys, so there you have it. In conclusion, if you're in the market to get a robot vacuum, seriously, look no further than the amazing Xiaomi Mi Robot Vacuum as it is the hands down the best for its price and the overall features. Now in addition to the vacuum, you can also buy the virtual wall which is sold separately as this virtual wall comes in handy if you have any fragile items which you don't want the vacuum to go and bump into while cleaning your home. Special thanks to the guys from Ace Pro for sending out this vacuum and if you guys are from Malaysia and if you're interested to get the Xiaomi Mi Robot vacuum, I will leave a link at the description below with a direct link to Ace Pro's website. And among all the online sellers, I highly recommend these guys because not only the website is the cheapest but their knowledge on the items are way better than any typical resellers out there. Now as for my friends who are watching overseas, I will leave links below as well. If you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Adam Lobo TV if you're new or if you haven't done so. Don't also forget to hit the bell icon just next to it to get notified for my weekly videos. Thank you so much for watching. This is Adam Lobo and I'll catch you guys next week.